Hi, this video explains how to alter the basic comfort settings on your WPM2 controller. When you open the flap, the first menu you come to is Room Temperature HC1. If you press Program, you'll enter the menu. What you'll notice is you've got Day and Night settings. If you want to adjust a setting, press Program and use the dial to change the setting, and then Program to confirm. If you have an FE7 room thermostat, these temperatures switch off the heating pump. If you don't, these temperatures relate to an offset of the heating curve. To change the heating program, scroll to the right so you get to the heating program menu. Press the program twice to enter the menu. And what you'll see is you've got a 7 day, 3 period timer, which is currently set in day mode between 6 in the morning and 10 at night, and at night mode between 10 and 6 in the morning. You can alter the days individually or all together. I'm going to alter them all together on the Monday to Sunday setting. At the moment it's set from 6 in the morning till 10 at night. But I'm going to change that from 6 in the morning till 10 in the morning on the day setting. And then from 4 in the afternoon till 10 at night on the day setting as well. So what you can see is between 6 and 10 we're set at 20 degrees. Between 10 and 4 we're set down at 18. Between 4 and 10 again we're set back at 20 degrees and then between 10 and 6 the following morning we're back down to 18. If you keep scrolling and pressing to back you will get back to the main menu. Now I'll explain weather compensation and the heating curve. The heat curve alters the water temperature in the buffer tank for your underfloor heating or radiators depending on the outside air temperature. To determine the right setting you need to know the design return temperature at the design outdoor temperature. The example is 35 degrees at minus 3 outside gives a curve of approximately 0.78. To adjust the heat curve enter the heat curve menu. It's factory set to 0.6. Use the program button to access the setting adjustments and use the jog dial to change them. The numbers at the top of the screen from left to right refer to the set return temperatures at 20 degrees 0 degrees and minus 20 degrees. Notice how when I change the heat curve the temperature at the top changes. The idea is the property maintains a constant temperature for example 20 degrees while the emitter temperature your underfloor heating or radiators varies depending on the weather.